Okay. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Hi, and uh, I want to thank you both for joining me today. I have um, Diane Meyer Simon and Mary Luevano joining me from the Global Green USA offices in Los Angeles, right? That's where we are. Yeah. Great. I was particularly struck um, several months back when I heard the Dalai Lama's quote in Vancouver that the world would be saved by Western women, and to me that, that meant so many things, and I wanted to, uh, to reach out to a lot of women that I knew doing remarkable, what I think is remarkable work for the world, and, uh, and start a dialogue. And so in doing that, I've been brought to you two today. And, and I wanted to ask each of you um, what that statement um, from the Dalai Lama means to you when you hear it. Well, the first thing I thought is what a responsibility that is on Western women. <laughs> and then I thought that actually what he was saying was that the feminine aspect of both men and women is what needs to be honored. You know, women are known for their intuition, their sensitivity, vulnerability, transparency, um, and men also have those qualities, but they haven't been reinforced in our society the way they should be. And I see more and more men who listen to their intuition. In fact, Mikhail Gorbachev, who founded Green Cross and Global Green, actually, um, always said that women, especially in the environment, were the leaders. And I think that's one of the reasons that he came to me to found Global Green USA and to be on the board of Green Cross um, was because I was a woman. And I know his wife, Raisa, was very instrumental in his wanting to start a, a global movement. The environmental movement is popping up everywhere um, so quickly that we can't even keep a list of the new organizations that are popping up. And uh, I think in that way that men and women uh, all, all over the world are going to be in balance. Yeah, well, you know, Diane and I were talking about this before we got on with you, Lewis, and I interpreted the comment um, that the world will be saved by Western women in the same way Diane has this big job, but also um, almost ashamed that it, I don't feel like it's Western women, but women all over the world, and there are so many who have set the example, I mean, you, you know, just off the top of my head, you know, Benazir Bhutto in, in Pakistan, who gave up her life, and uh, Wangari Maathai in Africa, and, um, you know, all of these, and Mother Teresa, you know, you just, the list goes on, you know, Western women, in many cases, have a lot more resources at their disposal in order to um, accomplish the kinds of social and environmental ob objectives we have, um, and maybe that's what he meant, I'm not exactly sure what he meant, with that comment, but I think we and women all over the world, you know, with men in partnership can, can do great things. 